Hello, boys and girls. I am glad you have joined the English lesson. My name is Ksenia, and today we will read about the events that are celebrated in school. Let's get started. Every day we do similar things that are part of our daily routines. But on some days we can forget about them and have some joy and fun. The reason for it is some special day or celebration. And the school is not an exception. During the school year, students and teachers organize and celebrate important events. Here are some examples. The first day of school, Teacher's Day, Halloween, Christmas, and graduation. These are traditional school celebrations. What do teachers and students usually do on these days? On your screens, you will see two columns. In the first column, there are the names of different holidays. In the second one, there are descriptions. Take a pen and a piece of paper. Pause the video and match the descriptions with the right celebrations. Ready? Let's check the answers together. On the first day of school, all the students celebrate the start of a new school year. The answer is A4. Students congratulate their teachers on Teacher's Day. It is B5. On Halloween, we carve pumpkins and wear scary costumes. The answer C1 is correct. All the students love Christmas and wait for Santa to bring nice presents. The answer is D2. Graduation is the day when students finish a school year and celebrate the beginning of the summer break. It is E3. Well done! There are also many other events that are not traditional but are not less interesting. They are called theme days when students pay attention to some topic, historical event or life situation. On your screens you will see three photos that represent different events. They are Earth Day, Star Wars Day and Random Acts of Kindness Day. There are also some dates when these events are celebrated. Take a pen in your notebook. Pause the video and match the events with the correct dates. Let's see how you cope with this task. Earth Day is celebrated every year on the 22nd of April. Star Wars Day is held on the 4th of May. And the last but not the least event is Random Acts of Kindness Day, which is performed on the 17th of February. Good job! These school feasts are fascinating and require some preparation. For instance, Star Wars Day is a huge fancy dress event when students can come to the school in a costume of Jedi or Yoda, eat some tasty snacks and take part in class competitions. Random Acts of Kindness Day is a very special day because children learn to help and take care of their friends, classmates or teachers. They make a poster with many random acts of kindness, pick one and do it during the day. For example, write a thank you note to a teacher or make someone laugh. Another important event that is celebrated around the world is Earth Day. Anna, a secondary student, likes to organize it in her school. Let's read the advert that she prepared for other students and answer the question. What do people celebrate this day? Our planet is an amazing place, but it needs our help to be clean and beautiful. That's why each year on the 22nd of April, more than a billion people celebrate Earth Day to protect the planet from things like plastic and garbage. By taking part in activities like picking up litter and planting trees, we are making our world a happier and a healthier place to live. So why do people celebrate Earth Day? Correct. People celebrate this day to save and protect our planet. Do people have parties on this day? No, they don't. They celebrate it by helping out and cleaning up the places where they live or study. In schools, all the students go green. It means that they try to keep an eco lifestyle. Let's watch a short video and say how the students support an eco lifestyle in their school. What is your job at the school? We take juice boxes and put them in a green bin to get recycled at the recycling building. And then <laughs> we get some money. For field trips. It's a smelly job, but somebody has to do it. And these guys are doing a great job. 
I take all the recycling out of the um, from the school. Correct. The students sort waste before recycling. There are some other things that students can do to save our planet. Among them are a class cleanup event, recycled art competition, no cars and buses day, and plant a tree activity. Let's read together and match the titles with the correct paragraphs. A. A walk or bike to school day is a fun Earth Day activity because it helps to reduce air pollution, while also providing a perfect chance to have enough physical activity in the day. B. Students and staff work together to pick up trash and clean up graffiti next to a school. They discuss together the need to keep the Earth clean for future generations. This can be a fun way to meet neighbors and make new friends as well. C. It is a great opportunity to create a beautiful garden in the schoolyard. Children learn how to care for plants and the earth while also prioritizing nutrition and healthy eating. Such activity makes classmates real eco-superheroes, and they work as one team. This is a good time to talk about plant diversity and how different plants interact with each other. D. Students get thinking about ways to reuse everyday items that would otherwise be thrown away. This kind of event is great for the environment and inspires innovation and creativity. Bottle caps, paper towel rolls, plastic soda bottles and cereal boxes are some easy-to-find materials that can be transformed into impressive art. Well done! Now take a pen and a piece of paper. Pause the video and look through the text one more time. Write the titles to the correct paragraphs. Ready? Look at your screens, pause the video and check if you were right. Today we have talked about traditional school celebrations and activities. We got acquainted with the theme days and the way students celebrate them. We have also read a story about Earth Day and things we can do to keep an eco-lifestyle. Now it is your time to get green. Scan the QR code on your screen with a special application. Follow the link there. Choose the template and create a poster about Earth Day activities that we read today. Present it to your classmates. That is all for today. Good luck with your posters and see you next time. Bye!